Hezeon, Revelation 3. And unto the angel of the called out assemblies in Sardis write, These things says he that has the seven Ruachoth of Yahweh and the seven stars. I know your works, that you have a name, that you live and are dead. Be watchful and strengthen the things which remain that are ready to die. For I have not found your works perfect before Yahweh. Remember, eth, therefore, how you have received and heard, and hold fast and repent. If, therefore, you shall not watch, I will come on you as a thief, and you shall not know what hour I will come upon you. You have a few names, even in Sardis, which have not defiled their garments. And they shall walk with me in white, for they are worthy. He that overcomes, the same shall be clothed in white raiment. And I will not blot out his name out of the sefer of life. But I will confess his name before my father and before his angels. He that has an ear, let him hear at what the ruach says unto the called-out assemblies. And to the angel of the called-out assemblies in Philadelphia write, These things says he that is holy, he that is true, he that has the key of David, he that opens and no man shuts, and shuts and no man opens. I know at your works, behold, I have set before you an open door, and no man can shut it, for you have a little strength, and have guarded eth my word, and have not denied my name. Behold, I will make them of the synagogue of Satan, which say they are Yahudim, and are not, but do lie. Behold, I will make them to come and worship before your feet and to know that I have loved you. Because you have guarded the word of my patience, I also will guide, guard you from the hour of calamity, which shall come upon all the world, to try them that dwelleth upon the earth. Behold, I come quickly. Hold that fast which you have, that no man take your crown. Him that overcomes will I make a pillar in the temple of Yahweh, and he shall go no more out. And I will write upon him the name of Yahweh, and the name of the city of Yahweh, which is renewed Yerushalayim, which comes down out of heaven from Yahweh. And I will write upon him my new name. He that has an ear, let him hear at what the Ruach says unto the called-out assemblies. And unto the angel of the called-out assemblies of the Laodiceans write, These things says the Amen, the faithful and true witness, the beginning of the creation of Yahweh. I know your works, that you are neither cold nor hot. I would you were cold or hot, so then, because you are lukewarm, and neither cold nor hot, I will spew you out of my mouth. Because you say, I am rich, and increased with goods, and have need of nothing, and know not that you are wretched, and miserable, and poor, and blind, and naked. I counsel you to buy of me gold, tried in the fire, that you may be rich, and white raiment, that you may be clothed, and that the shame of your nakedness do not appear, and anoint your eyes with eye salve, that you may see. As many as I love I rebuke and chasten. Be zealous, therefore, and repent. Behold, I stand at the door and knock. If any man hear my voice, and open the door, I will come in to him, and will sup with him, and he with me. 
to him that overcomes will I grant to sit with me in my throne, even as I also overcame and am set down with my father in his throne. He that has an ear, let him hear at what the Ruach says unto the called-out assemblies.